Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to show you the, uh, the new Mercedes MyBad GLS 600 and this is the, uh, the brand that I never heard of it before called the uh, Jedi Toy now this is a subdivision from a Paragon model apparently so I only have uh, one Paragon model other than this one which is the uh, BMW Ice 8 and so which you will see on my channel soon uh, I'm gonna post that as well and so this one is kind of uh, new-ish and it's been out a while uh, I've seen it before but uh, I never thought I would go for it and then I decided that you know what I'm gonna give it a go and see what it looks like and as long as it's made of die cars and it has opening part and I will you know try it so here we are so I got this one from the CK model Dot de from germany uh, i got this one for i don't know how much i paid for it. in total i had to pay tax as well so roughly about uh, 150 pounds or so something like that so it is a little bit expensive but it's not too bad i have to say this comes with the mercedes uh, dealership packaging it's not like a nora for their own stuff with a windows dial it has their own mercedes uh, official packaging which is nice and uh, it comes in two only two colors you got a red one and you got a black one black one has a different interior color and uh, i prefer the uh, this red one because of the uh, i don't know it just looks nicer i suppose and it has a little bit different tones and because of black on the top and you got other black on this bottom part so it just make it a bit more different i suppose so anyway yeah so let's give it a look on this one so first impression is nice and solid it's kind of heavy so it is roughly about a kilo or so i would say uh, i'm gonna measure it later on and i'll put it on the uh, description as well so do check it out on the description i always put my details or the pros and cons and everything about what i post it on the uh, my channel so it looks very nice and i like all the chrome part of the uh, grill and this is really cool they make you feel like a sort of like a nicer quality plastic probably a metal piece I don't know it's hard to tell actually but uh, it has all the nice trimming on it you got my back and Mercedes logo and Mercedes logo is actually attached you know and it's not like a loose item so some of the uh, Nora model they can't like uh, keep coming off because they can't lose but this one is actually glue it <laughs> on the actual bonnet the light details are good and I feel that the grills is actually sealed but it feel like a decent depth on it so it'll make you feel like a, you know yeah I, I just like it so anyway the light detail also good and then let's look at the trunk the trunk inside there is like it's just like a Nora it's just one giant piece of molded plastic here there is no depth or anything like that there is no sticker no label nothing here whatsoever so that's a little bit disappointing and there is no you know struck style it's just a dot leg style here which is yeah just feel like a normal Nora and on top of that you got a little bit glued it mark here I can't get rid of it <laughs> but anyway I'm not fussing too much and on the side you got suspension as usual steering wheel linked with the front wheel as you can see here and the mirror don't fall right the only thing that is all the movable part is from the uh, Chinese brand like LCD, Can5 and things like that but the rest of the uh, you know these brands like Noraf and Paragon they don't actually do any of the moving part unfortunately but uh, yeah inside is not bad you got carpeted the seat doesn't move as I said and then all the detail and dyes are kind of visible and clear enough and it has double dual screen which is typical my bag and Mercedes layout and you got all the uh, sound speakers and all the stuff in there as well on the door panel which is nice and also you got all the dash and stuff there but they kind of molded piece on the uh, ceiling but the um, you know kill show and stuff is really cool you can find you can actually bring the sun visor down and stuff like that which is nicer but I'm not fussing too much here it's a reasonable price for what I pay for and I'm getting decent you know model uh, yeah so i'm fairly happy with it in general so uh, it's okay you know interior is really nice uh, i like the uh, sun roof here because it's actually opened up quite a lot of things and you can see the whole interior from the surface which is really cool unfortunately they don't actually open either not like a campfire <laughs> 
um, yeah so you don't expect anything moving part in this model uh, because you're not gonna get any uh, those are nice and soft close actually it's not like a slam like bang you know anything like that this is really cool and uh, that all the uh, silver chrome pieces on the door silver as well which is make it really premium you got my bad logo here and uh, obviously suspension on the back as well suspension and nice and soft kick actually it's nice feedback it's not jerky or anything like that i really like pressing this <laughs> really cool <laughs> i just like the feeling of it anyway and at the back i like this massive chrome door seal here which is really nice no heat line on the window which is annoying i don't know why they don't do that like in all the nora ice skills you know they don't do this kind of effects but i think they should do that you know make it more realistic and inside there is a really really big <laughs> i can see the massive loading space here and then you got in the center you got refrigerator with a little fan here as well which is very nice detail i gotta say carpeted all the way and i like all the little silver part here as well so in general the, i like the back of this car which is very nice all the little reflected here as well um yeah so overall it's really nice model uh, i'm very pleased that i bought it at the end i wasn't gonna buy it before <laughs> because i don't know the brand i only know norav and you know lcd and stuff but i decided to give it a go and i'm not regretting it or disappointed or anything like that i'm fairly happy with it so yeah here we are um i must say it's about a kilo like i said before and let's measure this up see how heavy this is yeah it's 1.2.1.25 actually so it is fairly heavy model so i think i'm gonna put this one in a special container box i'm not gonna be mixing up with the, uh, the rest of my collection so i'm gonna put all the suv together in a special glass case <laughs> look make it look more porch as i would say anyway so thanks for watching i uh, hope you enjoyed it um, it is still available from the CK model car if you're interested in getting this one uh, unfortunately this one is not available in any other part of the country or the world uh, I asked my source in China and they said they don't have this one they're not allowed to sell this in China so if you want this one you have to get it from Germany or like uh, from European market um, yeah so there we are it's kind of rare to be honest and you can't get it everywhere you want so, um, very nice. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Uh, I'll see you in the next video. Cheers.